What's up, everybody, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pixel on Soul and Fire. So, last episode, we did have that intense, shiny find, and oh wow, so I could get a whole leather cap from this place. And uh, we are in one of the towns right now, just hanging out in here, because uh, I figured, why not? And then uh, we can go make our way home in a bit when it is uh, getting dark and stuff. But what I think we're going to try and do today is level up Combustion. Combustion? I don't know. I call him Combustion. I, I don't know. Is that, you know what? Let's just, let's just, stats... R combustion yeah so we're just gonna rename him so I don't sound like an idiot if I pronounce his name wrong for the entirety of the series and ooh, what is that that looks uh, that looks fancy over there so let's go check out what this is I had no idea so uh, info oh it's just just another yeah it's just the gym info and stuff never mind got all excited for little to nothing so yeah, I don't know. So we're going to go try and uh, level up combustion as much as possible, as I did say. And uh, hopefully next episode or the episode after we'll actually begin or make our attempt at the grass gym. So uh, we obviously are, are we, we got to get ready. And actually, hey, look, this is a prime Pokemon for battling this weeping bell right here. That is actually similar to what he uh, what we should be seeing at the gym. So let's see. We'll uh, we'll just Ember this guy. And holy crap, I just realized he's like 90 levels higher than me. So this. Oh, we got a crit, though. So it's fine. It's fine. Please don't kill me. Yeah, I didn't realize we were only level 17 <laughs> or only level 16, not even 17 yet crap um see that would have been an awesome amount of levels but uh we did get our butts kicked but that's okay because we could switch into electabuzz who can uh, just discharge and probably do a poop load of damage yeah there you go even though it wasn't very effective so we get thunder wave now and uh, he, he is paralyzed and are we paralyzed no he's paralyzed yeah and then we could kill him off gaining a nice 3,000 experience which would have been awesome if we could have given it given it to uh combustion but unfortunately that did not play out as we thought it would. So, but that's okay though, because what we can do is go run back real quickly to the Pokemon Center and uh, go try and get him a few more levels again. So let's see. We will heal up really quickly. Look at that villager. He is, uh, he is, he's loving life. And I do wanna, I do, I do wanna clear this up, or I do wanna say again. I really like these shaders. I mean, I feel like it should be mentioned. I just, I'm really enjoying the shaders on this, um, just these shaders. I finally found some that I really, really like, and I just, I don't know, everything looks so, I, I enjoy just looking. And, uh, so we have a Laron. Laron clearly wants to battle, and this is actually a pretty high level. So if we can play our cards right, we can actually, crap, I always, I, I did the exact same thing twice in a row. So listen, I don't even know what this move does, so I figured I'd just natural gift <laughs> I, I don't know it doesn't it randomly I, I don't know but um yeah so Bayleaf is not gonna be able to kill this guy um I feel like we kind of already knew that though so our high, next highest level Pokemon is Electabuzz so let's see if we can't uh, Thunder Wave him and then go for he's probably really slow actually so we could try and elect Ball. Yes, he, he is really, considering we have a 11, oh crap, Jesus, Electabuzz is turning into a god, my god, so um, yeah, and a lot of you guys, again, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask, because um, I, I don't know, I don't want to do anything that, oh, look at this, I didn't even realize it was here, Doo, so we got a max potion, that actually, we may want to use that during a gym battle, or even the elite four, if we do get that far, oh look, I didn't realize there's a bunch of stuff up here, so this guy sells, um, oh, he sells Volt Switch and U-Turn. Oh, we can almost afford Volt Switch. This guy, he decided to come over here. And then there's a Choice Scarf, a Choice Band, Choice Spectacles, and a Choice Scarf, and some Leftovers. Ooh, those are all really, really good items. So we may want to get that. So there's a shop sign right there. So we can do this and uh, heal up really quickly. So let's see where we, uh, where we end up, where we end up after this. So, um, yeah, the guys are just, there. they're snorting away uh, to their heart's content. So, let's see, we got, we got, who's this? Miltank. Yeah, wow, did I really just ask? That? I didn't know who Miltank was. Wow. Wow. Okay, so, oh, what's this? This is the gym info, isn't it? Next step. Um, so, yeah, none of the gym leaders are spawning, unfortunately, this time. So, we, we are going to have to probably reconnect if we have to do the gym battle next episode. What is this? I don't know, there's some, like, little painting area, but that's kind of cool. So we can lock that up because we do not want to be breaking anything in there. That would be not good. Not good at all. So, let's see. Round... Wait. What? What was that noise? <laughs> why, why did it make it that noise? I don't know. Maybe you, my guys might not, you guys may have not heard it, but... It did make this weird noise. So yeah, let's try and get... To, we're, I'm going to shoot for evolving both... Bayleaf as well as um, 
as well as the other guy, uh, as well as combustion this episode, and hopefully we're successful in that endeavor. We can get some fishies, but I'm not too keen on grabbing it. Look at that. Look at that reflection. That was awesome. And um, so, yeah, wow, we actually sniped that Carvana out right there. So he's actually, they're actually faster than us, which is kind of annoying, but it's a-okay because uh, we are in the jungle biome. And this is the one thing I do love about uh, playing single player Pixelmon is I have the spawn rates jacked up. So tons of Pokemon are spawning and it just makes things so much simpler and uh, just so much nicer, honestly. It's it's peaceful this way, but um, that is great. Yeah, that's, that's great. So what we can do is run around a bit, and as I just say that, I don't even see any Pokemon. <laughs> so uh, spawn rates failed me this time, it looks like. We do, there's tons in that little lake though, so I mean, I don't know, uh, contradicting itself. So let's see, yeah, tons of Magikarp. The only thing I'm worried about is kind of getting lost. Like, I think town is that way, like my town is that way, but I'm not 100% sure on that. So this like guy's a level 44. But if I, uh, if I poison him, it should be actually doing a lot of damage. And I'm going to matter. Please don't kill me. I'm scared he's going to just turn around and, like, destroy me. So, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to, I kind of want to synthesis just because I'm so scared he's just going to kill me at one move. Okay, so he's going to continue to focus energy, which is kind of scary, but we are fine. I feel like my mouse is going so... See? That was... No, no! Oh, God. Oh, okay. Well, now we can switch into... Hmm. Electabuzz could probably kill him. So hopefully we can get a bunch of... Okay, he's going to crit Electabuzz. Uh-oh, this is actually turning out to be not so great. So we could Dragon Rage him. And, alright, he's going to Swagger. We could Dragon Rage... What? Oh, I was about to say, how the hell did Dragon Rage do that little damage? Oh, so he's going to critical hit Cross Chop us, but leave us with how much... I don't know how much HP we have, but it does not look like a lot. We're going to learn Peck. I could get rid of Growl for Peck. And, um, how, how much... He left us with one HP. Look at this, on Gyarados. Wait, wait, let me find Gyarados. Look at that. One HP. That is awesome. So yeah, Gyarados tanking that uh, cross chop critical hit, remaining with one HP. That's why That's why we love Gyarados. That's why he's our one of our favorite members of our team. Really, I love everyone on our team, though. And everyone did faint, so despite there being tons of good Pokemon to battle, we cannot really take advantage of it. And we haven't really seen any other grass Pokemon since we saw that um, Weeping Bell. So, I don't know. We gotta, gotta figure out a good way to find some grassies. And, uh, grassies. Grassies. The grassy? No. So, we do have a few, few ponytons hanging out over there. Let's jump the fence into Pokemon City and go heal up a bit more. And hopefully we can get some goodies from this. And, um, well, not some goodies, but, you know, just, just some goods. You know, gotta get the goods, man. Goods, goods, goods. So, as you can see, we're gonna spin, spin, spin. And uh, we still have Luxio Combustion. And, um, yeah, Bayleaf, I do want to level up this episode as well, because I feel like Bayleaf, if we can get a few, uh, poisons off, a few good poisons, we can, uh, actually do pretty good. So, Combustion did finally get to level 20. Hey, look, it's a boss! Oh, wait, no, crap, get out of here. Magical Leaf, what is with us finding- Oh, wait, what am I battling, an Arbok? Crap, I should have, um... Okay, please do, like, something stupid- No. <laughs> I didn't want him to kill me, but he did. So, yeah, but there's actually a boss, um, he might have flown away. No, it's right there still. So we could use Dragon Rage again, and we actually may be able to kill this guy and get a good amount of da or a good amount of HP. And oh god, he might kill me right now. No, he's not going to. Oh baby. Uh, yeah, I'll just Dragon Rage him to death unless he kills me. No, he's not. He's gonna Gastro Acid. I don't even know what that move does. And oh, come on, people, stop battling me. I'm trying to do something. <laughs> Twister, or we can Twister. Oh, quad. Twister does no damage, and he's gonna crit me. So we could just bite instead, which should kill him. There you go. So uh, oh god, is it still in the air? Oh, no, I think it went away. Damn it, I really wanted to battle that guy. But, of course, getting force battled does have its complications. Um, those, cr those pesky Pokemon. And uh, so we can open the fence gate. I was trying to jump over it. I've been tr I've been thinking about doing that. Oh, we could just sleep, actually. And uh, get that way. Actually, let's, let's level up Electabuzz once more, though. As long as there are Pharaohs around, let's not. And maybe we could even one-hit KO it. There you go. So that's why I love Electabuzz. You are awesome. And he's just such an easy Pokemon to level up in um, Pixelmon. Because there's just, again, so many Pharaohs around. And uh, I just it's, it's quite enjoyable. So what we can do is do that. Sleep in our bed. Get all nice and comfy. And continue on. So let's see. What, what else do we got? Do we got going on? Look at that sun, man. I mean, that is just snipe. Ah, oh, damn it. I thought we were going to be able to snipe it. Snipe. 
Oh, come on. That was, I got robbed on that one. So we got, oh, this guy's only level 23. We'll just, uh, want to, that's a quickie because uh, I don't want to bully him. That's just mean. So let's see, what else can we find out here? Again, looking for some grass Pokemon for two level combustion with, because uh, he is, oh, I thought that was, I thought that was a mini, I thought a mini primate was standing right there. I got really excited for a second, but it turned out to be something else. And that is a okay. So we actually do have Matt and uh, Matt's got some Scythers and stuff. So we should be able to get a few good levels off him and, Oh, we did get a burn, thank god, because I was going to say that did, like, no damage to Scythe. What the hell? <laughs> I cannot level up this combustion for the whole life of me. Um, well, I guess Scorpy? Yeah, let's, let's see if we can level up Scorpy a few. And then we can do a Poison Jab, because that is a thing. And Poison Jab's not going to be too, doing too much to these guys, but honestly, Scorpy has some really, really strong moves. Uh, he's going to kill us. Um, hmm. I guess I'll just stay in and ride it out. Now, yeah, he's gonna kill us though. Um, Luxio? Yeah, Luxio, you got this, dude. So he's gonna get hurt by his burn, and we can spark. So please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please. Yes, alright. So there you go. So we're gonna gain a good amount of levels. Luxio leveling up all the way to 22. Here comes out pra Paris, and uh, I think we could take on Paris. I mean, Paris kinda sucks. Uh, honestly, so we can try and bite him because uh, we actually do have a way higher attack than special attack. I did look that up. So, uh,. Ooh, if we hit him, we're fine. Damn it. Oh, no, wait, never mind. He went first. So, oh, we learned Roar. That's actually a pretty useful move to have. So, let's switch out now because I do not want to die. And, um, you know what, Gyarados? I, I believe in you. Even though we are fighting uh, generally some grass Pokemon, we could probably just bite them to death. Like so. Yeah, so just take a big chunk out of that uh, that Beedrill right there. And then bite him once again. Here comes out another Paris. And we can bite him as well. So, uh, wow, Paris, you actually took that like a champ. I totally thought I was going to just kill him. And here comes out another Scyther. These guys are scary, so I'm going to Dragon Rage. Showing Gyarados' skills. And we can Dragon Rage one more time for the kill. There you go. So... Gyarados leveling up. Oh, learning Ice Fang. That's actually really good. Um, especially on Gyarados. I didn't know you... God damn it. Traffic. Why y'all do that to me? Come on, man. We just just got a war battle. We were relaxing. Just gotta pop in and be like, hey, I want a battle too. And then it's like, ah, uh, ah, uh, and uh, then we're sad. All right, so we can magical leave this guy down. And oh crap, he just tackled me and took out half my health. So we're gonna have to switch into Gyarados, who can ice fang him. And uh, he's gonna baton pass. So that's interesting. Ice fang though. We should do some fun damage with that. Oh my god, Jesus Christ, he just basically killed me. All right, come on. Live. All right, there you go. Boom. So even if he, uh, even if we die, we will be fine. So we get Ice Fang one more time, just for the kicks. And um, oh wow. So we actually, I, I didn't think we were gonna survive that long. So Bailey finally getting to level 30. We're gonna have to go back and heal up really quickly. And um, oh, so we found some glowstone dust on the ground. That is always fun. And yeah, seriously, I can just not level up combustion, no matter what I do. We keep having one issue upon another with leveling him up. So what we'll do is heal up here. I mean, yeah, seriously, we got him the first four levels, really, or the first, like, 10, 12 levels, really easily, and then, uh, now it's just struggle, struggle, struggle. So we still have our Pokédex. Pokédexes are really useless, though. I mean, I don't know. I, I, does anyone in Pixelmon, like, to any of you guys, post in the comments below, do you actually use the Pokédex? I never do. I mean, it doesn't really have any useful information. Um, Rhyhorn. Oh, actually, we could easily take out this Rhyhorn. So there you go, and uh, yeah, I don't know, I just like, I feel, I want to, but I just, oh, I thought that was a boss, I got excited, but it's just a pharaoh, and hopefully it doesn't battle me, because, uh, not, not too keen on battling your type, and, oh, there's a Genghis Khan, I would have loved to catch a Genghis Khan earlier on in the series, but we didn't, and, um, alright, so let's go try and dig deeper into the forest, and there's a few pharaohs here, but Electabuzz is already such a high level compared to everyone else. He's like, he's six levels higher than everyone except Gyarados, who, uh, well, no, he's six levels higher than Gyarados, who's the second highest level. And then Bayleaf, and then, and then after that, it's just, it's just, it's just stumbles, and, oh, come on! Alright, Poison Powder him again. We could live this. Oh my god, he's gonna seismic toss us. Alright, alright. Switch into Electabuzz. Yeah, Electabuzz has got this. So he's gonna swagger us. And, um, oh, he confused me. So we'll Thunder Wave him. Oh, wait, he's already. Crap. Wait, can we Thunder Wave and poison him? He's gonna seismic toss on us. We could uh, do that. He's gonna get hit by his poison. If he, if we faster, we win. We are fast. Or, well, he didn't kill us, so we're. We win anyway. All right, so let's see. Combustion. We got to get you a good battle, man. Um, 
there's just nobody out here. Like, there's, there's no... I want to just find, like, one Pokemon that I'm super effective against, but I just can't seem to find one. Am I, like, forgetting one of his effectiveness? Like, is he super effective against something else and I'm just completely blanking when it comes to that? that that's a definite possibility, <laughs> but um, I don't think so. I mean... I don't really even see any grass Pokemon in this jungle. Oh, so we have a few bell sprouts here. A level 6 and a level 10. Wow. New records for how high of a level those guys are. So, yeah, we got some more more water Pokemon. But again, none of this stuff is uh, really useful to us. I mean, we could level up Bayleaf, actually, off these Sea Kings. That is a good method of doing that. But um, that guy is at Dodge City. So, oh, wait, did I just get... What attacked me? The Scyther, or, yeah, so the Scyther jumped down. We could try and take him on, but depending on his level, we might not actually even be able to kill him. So, please don't kill me. Thank you. And there you go. So, leveling up to 32, you learn Sweet Scent, Pleasant Aroma. That, uh, no, I don't do that. I'm not too keen on... Oh, we level, I forgot, Bailey levels up at 32. I always forget about those silly grass Pokemon that level up earlier, so that's awesome. There you go, Bayleaf. So, I'm proud of you, bud. You know, pat you on the back. Uh, well, I can't pat you on the back, but, you know, I can try. So, let's see. Um, yeah, Meganium. Meganium, Meganium, Meganium. Oh, Atropius in the wild over there. I saw that. I saw that in the corner of my eye. So, we got learned Petal Dance. I didn't know we learned it this easily. So, we're not really using Natural Gift. So, we can ditch that. And, um, Scyther, what level are you? I don't know. Part of me wants to catch a Scyther. But we just don't have any room on our team. Fortunately, he is at low level. And fortunately, also, they give us a good amount of experience. So he's going to fall swipe. But Ember should do a poop load of damage. Actually, it really shouldn't because it doesn't complement our stats. And it's just not that good of a move. But, oh, so he's going to crit us. But we should be able to finish him off getting a burn on the last move, of course. We learned Sand Attack. I am an anti-Sand Attack user. I hate that move. And um, I find it to be really cheap. But uh, what's going on down there? Oh, should we go down there? Nah, may maybe later. We don't actually have a flying Pokemon, so that would be a really bad idea. Because I don't think we'd be able to get out if we went down there. So I'm going to not do that. And all right, so I can't jump. I don't know. I feel, uh, is it lagging or something? I feel like I'm, I don't know, I'm having some some technical difficulties, I feel like. So where did that um, guy go? Um, oh, falling in the water. Hopefully we don't drown. And um, if this is the actual Pokemon games, we would have drowned already because uh, we can't swim. Uh, and, well, we do have a Gyarados, so maybe he would save us. But I feel like if Gyarados, given the opportunity, would actually just eat us. So, yeah, there's that. Um, I don't... I, I see... All I'm seeing is Bell Sprouts and not Pokemon that I want to wanna be battling, honestly. For Scyther... Or for, um combustion we did gain two levels which was good but uh, we're not gaining the massive amount of levels i was hoping we'd be able to get and that's kind of unfortunate you know i mean it's not that big of a deal because we could always just do the like kind of cheapy way to just like this uh well not like that not like that not exactly like that all right come on come. all right feral no stop making stop being just difficult just being difficult man boom all right and then we could just go like this and oh crap he might actually kill us uh, Alright, mirror move, discharge, we should be faster. And see, that's, but that's like cheap. I, I don't know. I feel like gross and dirty when I do stuff like that. So actually, both of them leveled up. But um, I guess that is unfortunately the way we're going to have to level them up. So uh, we still, wait, Bayleaf. Oh, he didn't change his name. I was actually going to, that's weird because I was going to change his name to be the proper one. But it didn't even change in the first place. So uh, that's kind of cool. So we can battle this Golduck because he is a really high level. And please don't kill me. You may kill me. All right, Fury Swipe's awesome. That's not going to do too much damage. We can Discharge. Should be faster. There you go. And got a Paralyze, so we're going to be faster, definitely. And there you go. So you're getting 2,700 experience, leveling up only twice. Wow, yeah, this guy takes so much uh, so much experience to level up. So, um, I should probably... Oh, there you go. There's a Pokemon I could battle, but um, I don't have any potions, so... I'm going to have to get some when we go back, because we're, we're starting to take longer journeys. Yeah, well, it's actually a really high level. Oh, oh I thought that was shiny, or not shiny, um, uh, whatchamacallit? I forget, what's the thing that's other than shiny? Uh, I don't know. So he's going to Foresight, though, and what we can do is Ice Fang and see how much damage that does, because, I don't know, it might do a lot, might die, no, no, no. All right, so we'll Dragon Rage instead, and that'll do a lot, because this guy is a low HP Pokemon. 
And Dragon Rage is just such a good move. It's like, it's so overpowered. <laughs> if you think about it, just 40 HP of damage. So we should finish him off right there. Gaining, actually, we didn't really gain that much more experience than uh, we did before. But we still did get to level 27, thankfully. And we got to get out of here before it gets dark. Because, um, as we did see previously, in the dark, things do get kind of dull. And not dull, but you, like, can't see anything with, uh, with the texture pack. Not, uh, with the shader pack. So, uh, yeah, we gotta definitely try and get out of there before uh, things get too scary for us. So, we'll jump, 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 oh, like that. <laughs> Jesus, it is just, like, boom, dark. And, uh, so we can, uh, do a magical leaf right there. And then run over this way and get back into town and follow the yellow brick road here. Or the, just, just the path, it's not actually a yellow brick road. And uh, go to sleep again. And uh, hopefully next, next tomorrow, we'll uh, be, what, what is that? Someone saw that, right? You guys, I mean, there's a little thing on the ground. So, yeah, we'll go to sleep, take a quick, nice bed, get a good night's rest. And then go on tomorrow to continue our journey as I take a drink of water as well. And scary noises as well. <laughs> like, what? What does that noise mean? I don't get it. But I'm just going to accept it. So, let's see. Pokemon City yet again. Hello. And um, I get the feeling you're going to be like a nine, level 90. No, oh, you're only level 30. Is that guy transparent? Oh, he looked transparent. Oh, did you draw? Oh, dude, that is so good. This stuff, it sells for like three um, thingies. And actually, no, I'm not going to value you yet. What we can do is switch into... Let's switch into Meganium. Actually, wait, no crap. We're not... <laughs> that was not a good idea. Uh, because I knew he was going to be able to do a poop load damage. We can pedal dance, though. It's not going to be very effective. And he's probably going to kill me. But um, hey, we'll pedal dance anyway. It's okay. So, we can switch back into Gyarados. Hey, oh my god. I feel like Arbok's cry is so loud. Holy crap. <laughs> it's just like, my ears. But that's okay. Because, oh crap, he did a lot of damage. But, yes, so we did get Combustion to 28, who loves to learn Bulk Up, boosting its attack and defense stats. So, we could get rid of Scratch, because, frankly, I don't think we've ever used it, to be honest. So, let's see, Combustion. What else can we, uh, can we have you battle? Is that a boss Pokemon, or is that just something red? Oh, oh no, it's a Zok Zokorak, dude. I don't really know what these things do. Um, we just don't have any good moves. That's our problem, honestly. Like, we just don't have anything, like, even against that Zokorak, dude. I, I don't have anything um, to battle it with. So we can instead, we could just use Electabuzz, get the Power Hacks. Oh, he's still going to hit through. He's still faster? Jesus, that guy must be really fast then. To hit through, paralyze, and be faster still so we can switch into electabuzz yet again and hopefully he doesn't just stomp us oh he's gonna confusion that's i should have paralyzed him uh because he oh no or he could just drop the ball and let me kill him that works for me too so combustion level 29 and holy crap electabuzz level 40 wow you are kicking butt man so uh, i kind of want to keep him at full hp so i'm just gonna stick it out um or i want to keep combustion at full hp so we could finally get him to evolve we can uh actually do stuff so we can kill him with that getting super or being super effective is always super helpful i remember that's how i uh, trained up jolt jolteon not jolt neon uh jolteon the in the original well not the original it was one of the one of the earlier on pokemon let's plays i'm one of the my basically my first like good team i had that i used competitively i remember that team that was a fun team all right so let's go see if we can't find someone else look how little that shinx is our Shinx is shiny, though. Ho oh, ho. And now it's a Luxio, so yay. <laughs> um, so yeah, we have all of these birds flying around, and yet we... Okay, I was going to battle you, but guess not. <laughs> Who killed him? Was that Miltank? Did you did you do that? I don't know. But uh, let's see if we can't find one of these guys to uh, battle. This is a nice level 36. There you go. Okay, dodge. Dodge. Okay, getting hurt now by some random... Po oh my god, come back. No, stop it. Okay, well, that guy's gone. Um... Yeah, I don't, he, he totally dodged the Pokeball. Is that an Electabuzz? Electabuzz? Oh, I didn't know this spawned in the wild like that. Hmm, that's kind of cool. I guess, not really, actually. Because it makes me feel less special for having an Electabuzz. Actually, I think I did know they spawned in the wild. I think they were just a lot less common after the update. Oh, come on, Pharaoh. Yes, all right, perfect. So we could switch into Elect. Oh, my God. If he does anything, I'm dead. All right, he's going to... Okay, we accept that. That I would totally live. Okay, he's going to do it again, so I could win. Thank you. I think that was planned. Yeah, we, me and him, we sat down before the match started, and we're like, hey, let me kill you because I need experience. And he's like, okay. 
I'll just agility a bunch of times until I can't agility no more. Come on, snipe. Ah, damn it. So, combustion, we gotta work on our sniping skills a little bit. And this is actually the gym. So, he is there. Um... No, I'm not going to go for it yet. Next episode, we'll definitely try and make that attempt. Oh, God. Um, all right, so... Oh, wait. It's a level 11 Ratatata. I thought it was... How is Ratatata faster than me? We're level 33 Gyarados, and the Ratatata's faster. How? I, I don't even know. So, we can switch into Electabuzz. He's probably going to kill us. Okay, or he's not. Why does no one kill Electabuzz? I swear. All right, so we could discharge... I may have, sh I probably should have, um, thunder waved, but I don't know. We'll see how it plays out and we could dra yeah, I should have thunder waved. <laughs> so, uh, we could go for some poison stuff right now. Uh, we'll go for poison jab. It's not going to be very effective actually. Crap. Yeah, that was really dumb. I could have bug bited, but now he's probably going to kill me. Luxio, maybe Luxio could get a po or get a paralyze off. Maybe. Uh, we could spark. We'll see what happens. Probably not. Oh, oh, we got a crit, though, so that's actually going to help a bit. And, oh, oh, hello. Get, what? What? This Luxio is crit central. Holy crap, two crits back to back. Setting the stage for Combustion. If Combustion drops the ball on this one, I'm going to flip out. Oh, my God. All right, so, yes, using an Ice Fang. There you go, gaining the 4,600 experience all for himself. Learning Quick Attack. Uh, actually, no, I'll get rid of Peck because Peck kind of sucks. And wow, so that Luxio has gotten like more, it has gotten the least amount of battles, but more critical hits than anyone else on our team. That was crazy. So we have four levels to go before we do get the uh, one, the only, please again. So, <laughs> I, I see, you like what I did there. And um, I actually, I didn't realize there was leftovers and stuff in that other gym, I may, or in that other town. I may want to go uh, try and explore some of these other towns now and see what other goodies are in them. Because I, I definitely want to get that. Wow, this is a really tiny lucky. And uh, yeah, because I kind of, I, I do want to definitely get that, those leftovers and um, a choice scarf even. But um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So um, he still has all crap moves, but I guess we could try and... Make something happen here. He's gonna spit up on me. That's disgusting. He he just he just essentially puked on me. So we can bulk up. Um, actually, this is not gonna help me at all. Uh, yeah, my attack and defense was increased, but now I have to use double kick. Yeah, that doesn't help me really, does it? Because Ember. I mean, it'll make me a little bit tankier, but hopefully I get a burn relatively soon, so I don't. Um. Oh, he poisoned me. Crap. Uh, this is actually gonna be kind of bad. Actually, maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, he get if he kills me right now, I'm pissed. But we killed him, thankfully, and level 33, so we're going to have to go. Actually, you know what I'll do instead, rather than uh, going back, because uh, it's a pain in the butt to run back and forth all the time. We'll just do this and switch into our brand new Meganium. And uh, since Meganium is not going to have any problems with the confusion, since we're going to be getting out. Wow, you, how did you survive? What? Is Meganium that bad? Jesus. How did he survive that? That's an oh, my God, the red boss, the red boss, go. That's intense mood. That's called the intense music. So let's see. What level do you think this guy is? He's probably way out of our price range. Actually, he's really not. Uh, Thunder Wave. Don't kill me, please. Fudge. Uh, um. Well, Gyarados has the next highest possibility of killing him because uh, he can just Dragon Rage him down. But I kind of don't. Are, uh, okay, he has no effect. Oh my god, Gyarados, if you do this. Baby, if you do this. Oh, baby. God damn it, I got all excited, only to be shut down. Um, Well, we could poison powder, and we might be able to stall him. So he's going to leer. Actually, that's perfect. Yeah, we, we won. We won. There's no way. I'm going to synthesis just in case he does. Nope, okay, he's going to kill me. Yeah, I don't think there's... I could stall him long enough to uh, win. So, oh, you know what I should do? I should have switched into combustion, but you know what? Luxio could use the uh, extra HP. He's going to pluck. And. Oh, perfect. There you go. So, oh, wow. So we got Sludge Wave, an Iron Hammer, Metronome, a Power Ankle, and a Pokeball. Wait, why don't we gain experience? What? What? <laughs> I thought we get. Why didn't we gain any experience? Oh, because we died too. Wait, how did we die? Wait a second, what? Did it attack me? It didn't say it attacked me, did it? I don't think so. 
I don't know, but we're gonna get our blaze again this episode. I will be I'm committed, you know <laughs> I will stay as long as I need to to get this blaze again because uh, Yeah, I, don't know, I want it, but um, I can't believe that didn't uh, I Thought that was gonna give us a ton of experience. That's why I got all excited, but um, I was obviously mistaken. Is that another boss? That's a blue boss now Look at that. All right. Come on Pharaoh. Don't fly away from me, bud. Don't do this to me, man. Come on, man Come on, man. Oh my god. He's gonna do this. He's gonna do this right now. Really? Really? Alright, Gyarados, let's do this, baby. So, back-to-back -back bosses. Not sure what's going on here, but, um, okay, okay. Whoa, whoa, he's getting away, getting away. Stop, 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 stop screwing around now. Alright, get on the Gyarados, get on the Gyarados. Okay. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Tell me you just despawned. Nope, get out of the water. Come on, man. Come on. Barrow? Where'd it go? Oh, my god. Did it really just despawn? We both, but, but it was, it was right there. Oh, man. Did it really just despawn? Just like that. It's gone. Is that another one? No. How? It was right there. I can't believe. <laughs> that sucks. I didn't realize. I didn't. This. I guess it just left our chunk, and that was it. So there's a level. Actually, that's a pretty high level Pharaoh. Kind of want to battle him. Um. Oh, and of course, as soon as I go to. Yep. Yep. That's that's how that's how life works sometimes. But uh, as I said, we are committed, and there actually are some beds over here, so that makes it much easier. What is that? Oh, Graveler. Hello. And um, these guys actually give good experience. So we could switch into Meganium, who also could use some good experience, and Magical Leaf. Boom. And level 34 and level 33. <gasps> oh. I, s I changed my numbers back to normal, so that's a legit legendary. I think. Oh. <laughs> the, the darkness comes in on sets, and wow, that is imp I can't see anything. Thank God I know where this bed is. Uh, oh crap, do I? I can't see. Uh, well, it's in this tent, is it? Not? How do I get in the tent, though? Do I have to go around the other side? Um, oh, there you go. Yeah, seriously. Those tent things are kind of crazy. <laughs> They're, uh, or the darkness, how dark it gets is kind of insane. Like, that's kind of unrealistic, um, but that's okay, because what we can do is, no, that's a, whoa, what level is that guy? All right, he's a, he's a pretty high level, so we can battle him, and, or we can miss, and try again, and try a third time, oh, god damn, oh, no, I thought I, I thought he battled, uh, someone else, but no, we are on task with where we want to be, so let's see, let's, uh, we'll just, no, he's gonna confuse me, we'll dragon rage once, boom, Nope, no Dragon Rage. We'll actually get confused. He's going to drag out this battle like 90 turns. And that's okay, though, because we could Dragon Rage now. There you go. And then we could finish him off with an Ice Fang, which has a 5% chance of missing, and it does not. So thank you. Oh, God, that gave us no experience. Um, All right, Pharaoh. Fa oh, level 44 Pharaoh. Come back. No, no. Not again. Not again. No. Bisharp's actually really high level, though. So we could battle them instead. So come on, Bisharp. Let's do this, baby. So, oh, please don't just one-shot me. All right, so you're gonna Fury Cutter. That's a crappy move anyway. So we get Thunder Wave you. Actually, wow, yeah, he's a really high level. So let's just try and discharge this guy. And uh, we're gonna try and peg him down as far as possible. Hopefully he doesn't have any good moves. And he's getting the full power hacks. The full extent of Electro or Electabuzz's power. And we just won. That's what's up. That is what's up. So one more level to go. And this Bisharp can hold the key to that one level. So uh, let's switch into Electabuzz. As long as it doesn't like one-shot us right now. Okay, that that, that is uh, getting one-shotted. So we could Dragon Rage him. It depends how much HP he... Yeah, he is. He's a pretty high HP Pokemon. Don't kill me. All right, so he's going to Embargo again. He's like throwing the match for himself, but that's okay. Oh, wow. He's literally throwing the entire... Unless he kills me right now. Yeah, nope. He's going to throw the match. But there you go. Finally, level 36. Combustion is evolving. So uh, there you go. So Combustion is evolving. Here we go, guys. This is what we've been waiting for for the entirety of this episode. Let's see. Combustion. Combustion. Hello. Hello. Or actually, Combustion. Goodbye. Blaziken. Hello. And uh, let's see. So there you go. Look at that guy. That guy is sexy. He's about the same height as me. And oh, baby. So I think he actually learns a new move. Yes, that is such a good move for Blaziken. So we did learn Blaze Kick, and now Blaziken is a force to be reckoned with. And ladies and gentlemen, I think we're finally ready to take on a gym. Maybe a few more leveling, but next episode, we will be taking on the first gym. So I thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you all next time.